The heated steering wheel project I've been working on for my Subaru Forester is now complete. Um, the basis of it was taking the steering wheel and wrapping nichrome wire, very thin 36 gauge, around the uh, hand grip areas um, and wiring it to a 12 volt to 220 volt transformer, uh, which I got on eBay for pretty cheap. Um, all right, so to demonstrate it, I've got this temperature sensor, which should tell us the temperature of the cold steering wheel. We'll see how that changes when the uh, transformer is turned on. So here is the wheel. So you can't see the wires because they're under the leather cover. Let's see if camera knows how to refocus. It might just be stuck with the initial focus. All right, so the switch I installed is right here. Um, very hard to see. Okay, how about that? There we go. So it has two settings. Uh, besides off, there's high and low. So the high sends 220 volts from the transformer, and the low sends 175 volts. Um, those correspond to about 64 watts for, of heating and 48 watts of, of heating. So what we'll do is turn the heater on to high while monitoring the temperature of the wheel. Um, so right now it looks like it's about 60 Fahrenheit. I'm going to turn it on and let's see what happens. And just a few seconds later we're seeing the temperature rising. 68, 69, 70. And it sort of heats all through here, and then the top of the wheel is not heated. So here we're seeing it at 57. Seventy seven degrees. And then the right half is heating as well. Whoop. And we refocus. So it looks to be not as warm on this side. Whoa. Just on 80 briefly. Well, maybe not as warm specifically on the 3 o'clock position. About 80 Fahrenheit on the grips now. 85. Right, so that's the uh, that's the project. Should make outdoor parking in Wisconsin a bit more livable. Thanks for watching. Bye.